Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Poppy Eats. Today I'm back at Freddy's, my favorite burger place. I discovered it here in Charlotte. I never lived near one, never heard about them. Tried it, loved it. Um, I'm here courtesy of Freddy's. They actually sent me a gift card to come try some of their new stuff, which I admittedly probably wouldn't have gotten otherwise. So we're gonna see if it's amazing. We're gonna see if it wows me. Let's talk about it a little. Let's give it a shot. Um, what do we have here? Oh, I got their fries, because they talked me into getting the combo. There's their little shoestring fries. Not bad, pretty good flavor. I'm hoping they gave me some Freddy's sauce. I think that's what it's called. I have no idea. Um, what we're really here for is the new red, white, and blue burger. And the return of their pumpkin pie concrete. I'll show you that in a second. So, red, white, and blue burger. Um, maybe the wrong season for it, but based on what's on it, maybe it's never the wrong season. Oh, this looks good. Now, right, let me take it out. There it is. Okay, so, ooh, she's messy. You got your double Freddy's burger, smashed patties. They taste fantastic. Now, the trick with this one, though, I can show you. It's got red, white, and blue. So it's got Frank's Red Hot, and that's on the bottom mixed with mayo. I don't know if that's supposed to be the white, but you also got some blue cheese crumbles on top, which is your blue. But it's also colored white, so, you know. So we've got that. Then we have the pumpkin pie concrete, which is an entire slice of pumpkin pie blended into a drink, topped with cinnamon. Um, sounds good. I've never had pumpkin pie. Can you believe that? I've had enough pumpkin spice things, but I've never had pumpkin pie. Let's get our stupid selfie thumbnail with us. Uh, let's get that good old Freddy's logo showing. Yeah, all right. This is my cheat meal for the week so far. I've behaved all week. So, looking forward to this. Let's try the burger. Um, the red hot and mayo is on the bottom. It's not a ton of it. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. I love Frank's Red Hot. I love blue cheese. That's a wing thing for me. I love those. And I love my Freddy's Burger. But I don't know if I want them together. Can't be bad, right? Let's try it. <laughs> you need to open more of these places. I love this. I love this burger. So much. I had to drive 20 minutes to get it, though. Um... That said, that bite had none of the goodies, like the new stuff. Mm. Very good blue cheese crumbles. I still don't think I'm getting any of the Frank's Red Hot, though. Mmm. That works. Um, you gotta love blue cheese. I do. It's a very strong, very potent blue cheese. It's a straight up blue cheese crumbles there on the top. The Frank's Red Hot gives it a nice kick to balance that out. I think I could have used more. They didn't put a ton on. That would have helped. So maybe order extra on yours? Can't hurt. It works. It's really good. I've had debates in the comments. <clears throat> this is my favorite burger. Like, of every burger chain, everywhere I go, this is the one. This is good. This is my favorite. But other people like some other burgers better. And you know, you're allowed to. We can disagree. I think this is way more flavor than any other burger chain burger, or even most non-chain burgers I've ever had. Let's try this concrete. Because I got this as the drink in my combo, which I should have got a Mountain Dew because I'm really thirsty. And I don't know if this is going to quench my thirst so much. Actually, apparently, real talk, I learned thirst isn't a real thing. Like, you're never actually, like, thirsty. There is no thirst to be quenched. It's other things. Like, the concept of thirst is something we kind of came up with. There's no physical, like, oh, he's not thirsty. Like... Like, we have quenched that thirst, you can't do it. I don't know. Weird stuff. 
Um, let's try this. Tons of whipped cream on top. It's nothing to really show you yet. You can see the cinnamon, kinda. Good God, that's a spoonful. All right, now that I'm past the whipped cream, kinda. Yeah, that's good. It's exactly what they say. It's pumpkin pie mixed with ice cream. The crust pieces are in there. You can't really see it because there's so much whipped cream and ice cream. Yeah, that's really good. If you like pumpkin pie and ice cream, Get their pumpkin pie concrete with your burger. You will enjoy. Mm -hmm. Brain freeze. Almost. I got out of it. That's good. You're back to that. Um, did they give me the sauce? They did! It's fry sauce. That's what I wanted. Freddy's famous fry sauce. I think they have a spicy one too. I didn't really think too hard. There was no line at the drive-thru, I just, I went for it. I love their fry sauce. I'm gonna drown these fries in the fry sauce. Yeah, so good stuff. Um, what was their last special burger? It was like a steakhouse burger. That was really good, too. I don't know if I like one over the other. And this is great. I think my favorite burger here, though, so far, is just the, the regular one. I don't know. There's something about it. Uh, but you can't go wrong with any of them, really. Every time I do a Freddy's video, someone in the comments tells me to get their, like, California-style one. I'll do it one of these days. So I got startled. There's construction going on across the street from here. Um, this whole area is like a brand new plaza. I don't know how new it is, but it all looks very new. All the businesses are cool and hip, so I assume we've got a bunch of new ones coming in here. Maybe some new fast food stuff? I don't know. I complained it was 20 minutes, but it's an easy drive. Everything is 20 minutes in Charlotte. I'm gonna go a mile up the road towards the city, 20 minutes. Wanna go to the town 15 miles away, 20 minutes. I once said the fries were kinda comparable to McDonald's in flavor. I don't know, a little. I don't know about that. I'm sure you'd disagree. I don't know, that's still the way I lean though. Hope y'all are doing well. I usually do it like a mukbang type thing when I get my Freddy's. I feel bad, I usually go on some crazy rant while I'm sitting here. Nothing to really rant about. Football started back up last night. Real football, not the college kids playing where like two people on the team are good and one of the teams is stacked and the other one's terrible. And you steamroll and you got like 40 point spreads. I hate college football. It's so boring to watch. Feel free to disagree. Or you do you. I also watch a bunch of other stuff you'd probably find not entertaining as well. NFL is back. Decent game. Uh, I thought it was going to be closer. I picked the Bills to win. And they did. They won. They covered the spread, which is only two and a half points. But I thought the Rams would have been a bit closer. What I learned today, apparently, is that there were enough Bills fans in that stadium that they had silent snaps, silent counts for uh, some of the plays for LA. They were When they were on the field, they were being drowned out by Bills fans. That's funny. I hate how desperate the NFL was to make 
LA work again as a as a city for for NFL. As the teams were there, then they moved down. And they tried to bring some back. The city just doesn't care. It's mostly Raiders fans. Even though they won the the, the Rams won the Super Bowl. Yeah, whatever. Still thought it'd be a closer game. I'm a Dolphins fan. So I'm really hoping they beat the Patriots this weekend. That's one of the games I'm looking for. Um, Carolina, that's going to be interesting. They got Baker Mayfield, and they're playing Baker's old team. I don't know how that's going to go. I guess I'm rooting for Baker after they pushed him out for that rapey freaking Deshaun Watson. What a trash organization. That's sad. They're the ones that pulled the trigger on it. All the talk was about the Dolphins doing it. And the owner of the Dolphins is a scumbag too, so. That could have been us. I don't know. Would have been hard to cheer for. Probably would have made me a Bills fan finally. <clears throat> Not this year. Not this year. This is also good. I love Freddy's. I love it. And as delicious as this concrete is, I could go for like a real drink, like a Mountain Dew or a anything that's not ice cream. Well, that's because I'm really thirsty, right? This is an okay combo. You, you would be fine with this most likely. That's good. There's a lot of construction going on here. Duke Energy truck just pulled up. Let's get back to this burger though. That was a noise. Yeah, I just wish it had more, more of the Frank's Red Hot. There's a combo that works very well. Uh, what else is going on this weekend? One of my subscribers wants me to go try the, that stupid Pizza Hut Detroit style pizza. Um, it's not that it was bad, but it was like not good. Like you can get better Detroit style pizza anywhere else that does Detroit style pizza. I've done like two videos on it. It's back. I wasn't going to do it again. But she really wants to see it. So you know what? I just might do that. I just might do that. Person's also a Twitch streamer. And I have somehow like been watching Twitch all week. Like, I, I'm not a Twitch person. I have the Twitch. I've played on Twitch. But I don't watch it. But I have been. And I've been enjoying it. Just blowing my mind. At some point, I think I'm going to get back into the whole game streaming. I don't think it's going to be on the YouTube channel I made. I think I'm going to go delete that. I think it's going to be on Twitch. We'll see. I just don't have the time. I don't have the time. Hmm. Yeah, if I had to recreate this burger, almost perfect. I wouldn't combine the Frank's Red Hot with the mayo. I would just do more Frank's Red Hot. If you're into those flavors already, I think you could handle more of the heat. I, I don't think you need to dumb it down. You've already made it a wildly bold burger with the blue cheese. Go all in on that. Don't water down the red hat. No, that's good. A straw. Can I drink the concrete? The pieces of the pie wouldn't go up the... Look at this straw! 
Ah, can't do that. You gotta eat it with the spoon. Mm. Yeah, so I don't know. I might do the Pizza Hut thing. But then I have a whole giant Pizza Hut pizza I have to eat. And I have to go to one of the two nearby sketchy, sketchy, sketchy Pizza Huts. I don't know. I don't know what else is going on this weekend. Yeah, Sunday I'm going to just sit there watching football all day. You know, I want to see the Panthers. I don't know if there's any other games that are crazy competitive. I was going to do a Poppy's Picks of the Week, but I don't think enough of you care. But if you do, let me know and I'll do it in my next video. If I get one out tomorrow. Um, what else? Yeah, I think as much as I hate to cheer for anything remotely Clemson related, I think Jacksonville, I think they're gonna pull it out. They're gonna beat Washington. They've given Trevor Lawrence the right weapons there. Kid's not bad. No! I lost a fry. I don't know when I'm gonna get it. I signed up for one of those car wash packages, but the place, they do an awful job. The kids washing your car, or rather cleaning out the interior, they do an awful job. They do an awful job on the windows. I've always had streaks all over them leaving the place. I regret tipping them because they did such a bad job. They'll never get that fry. I think I'm gonna cancel it. Clean it myself. If you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. And that's the lesson I've been learning recently. Um, we recently hired somebody to do IT in our India office, which is great because I don't want to do this stuff for overseas offices. And now we have somebody there that can do it. But my boss is on this mad like desire, this freaking rampage to make him do half the US stuff. And that's pissing me off tremendously because that's my job. He's like, well, you got too much to do. And I'm like, yeah. But I want everything done right. Otherwise, I have to fix it anyways. And now we have pissed off employees and I'm doing the work anyways. What I need is a second employee. I'm doing my job. I've been saying it for months. It's becoming more and more obvious. Someone else on the team just quit. And they're like, oh, hmm. <laughs> maybe we do need another person. I don't know. Daily frustration on that one. Hey. I'm out here doing this. I got a message. Apparently somebody needs something working over the weekend. I didn't know. Because I didn't talk to him. The dude in India talked to him. And he... Didn't realize we only work half days on Fridays, apparently. I don't know. Dude, the guy needs help, though. He's a nice guy, so I'm gonna... I'll fire up my computer later and fix his issue. That pisses me off, though. I devoured this. Huh. Man, I'm getting full. Uh, good stuff. Really good stuff. Thanks to Freddy's for hooking me up with that. I, uh... But I've tried it anyways. I mean, probably, because it would have been an excuse to go to Freddy's. I love Freddy's. I love this stuff. It's not even remotely good for you, and I think that's the best part. It's just delicious. Make sure you eat your fries while they're still hot. Because mine are getting cold. They're not quite as good. I 
it's not like when, say, Boj yeah, Bojangles, when their fries go cold, worst fries ever. Best fries ever when they're hot. Very polarizing. My camera is overheating. I appreciate you guys being here. Hit that subscribe button. If you want to see more like this, leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought. Hit that like button if you liked the video. I really appreciate it. You guys take care.